And by the way, let's start this whole thing off by saying, just Do seeing that there's like actual cocoa and chocolate in this, our dogs don't get any. So if their sad little faces just happen to show up in the camera, ignore them. Chocolate not good for dogs. It's for your own good. It's for their own good, yeah, really. Okay, what? You look so long suffering. Let, uh, uh, I didn't teach him how to use a knife, apparently. So how y'all been? <laughs> it's been a while since I've been here. Um, it's been a while since Apollo Spaceball YT has actually been YT. YT? Mm-hmm. something I would want to eat. Mm-hmm. Okay. Now, we, uh, what are we doing next? Tasting it. Because we didn't smell. We didn't give a smell comment. Okay. That smells very brownie true. That's what brownie should smell like. True. A good, healthy, even chocolate smell without it being too overpowering. And no sugar smell. What's in here? Yeah, cocoa powder, sugar, a little bit of salt. A lot of butter. A lot of butter. Oh, there you go. That's why. That's why the texture is so good. Butter. Okay. Ready? We didn't texturize. We just looked. Okay, we have to do that when we eat. Here, okay. Ready? Three, two, one. Yeah, my favorite part, the edge. Corner. It's not very sweet. Which is good. Mm -hmm. It has a firm, chocolatey taste. Nice texture. Mm -hmm. Could be a little denser. Mm -hmm. It'd be great with milk. But we don't have any milk. We have milk. I can run and go get it while you talk. No, it's okay. We're not doing milk. We're doing brownie. It is good. I have to say, the dogs really want it. You can see the look on my kid's face down here. He's just like, <sighs> mm -hmm. but. 
to give you a rough idea how, how they would respond to the smell, they are kind of falling apart, which is kind of good. And there have been promises of walnuts in the next one. Oh, I want to sit here and eat these. It's pretty good. Mm -hmm. How much sugar are in here? Not much, right? Oops. There is not much sugar in these. <laughs> How did you like the recipe, Apollo? How was it making the brownies? I I helped make the brownies and it was pretty good. You you had to whip a lot of stuff. And you have to time it. It is a very time sensitive recipe. Is it? Mm-hmm. Well as far as what? You know, burn them? Mm-hmm. And how much you whip the eggs. Beat eggs, you get something. You whipped like and beat them. <laughs> what did egg ever do to you? Okay, well, listen, I think we're pretty positive on these. It's a shame you really can't see them any better or any longer because basically they're gone. Here, here's what the. I have to say, thing. these things are just about perfect for this time of day. And, <laughs> <laughs> and that's what the empty pot looks like. As you can see, they're pretty thin, so they cook pretty fast. Yeah. They weren't overly cake-like. Mm -hmm. However, possibly a little too smooth. Yeah. A bit over-whipped. The, but the, the very bottom and the edges were, were nice and flaky. Mm -hmm. Flaky? I guess so. <laughs> Okay. They're good. They're good. About ready for a nap. How about you? I really want a brownie. Hmm? Just saying. What do you think? Grumpy, would you like to try the brownies on camera? No. Not after we're done. We're at seven minutes. Well, I think this concludes it for this video. Yeah. Okay. Of Confection Perfection. Yeah, this is going to be a landmark one. Mm -hmm. you know, all of our videos from this point on will be compared to this one in so far as the quality is concerned. Yeah. Well, let them well. let them not be lacking and let's go into the future. Peace and love and understanding. Bye bye.